I wouldn't choose any out of it because I'm very, very easy and irritative. You see all this in Igbo when people they smoke for empty belly? Yeah. <laughs> and the result be that. You understand? Things get irritated to me so easily like that. So I don't know how I can cope with both. In, in the sense that when someone has a body odor or mouth odor, <laughs> I don't really appreciate that, you understand? Because when I'm going out with a lady, I discover such from her. <laughs> I'd rather sit her aside, advise her on this, what I discover from you, you understand? Are you serious? So in most cases, it's always difficult for some people to do, you understand? Unlike when you have such a mouth odor or kind of a body odor, it's not everybody can come out easily and tell you the secret. <laughs> Moreover, maybe a friend of yours that is a female like you, likewise too, hardly tell you the secret. Or probably you yourself, you can't discover it in yourself that you have such a... <laughs> you, you understand? You have such bod body odor or mouth odor. Okay. But you need someone to tell you that before you get to know. I don't know, maybe they can sense it on their own. That is another thing I can't really comprehend about that side. Ha! Body odor, mouth odor. I prefer body odor. Hey! Jesus Christ of Nazareth! <laughs> tell me why. Because... <laughs> Mouth odor is the, as in mouth odor is the, can still contain from your side. But body odor is everybody that will know that you have body odor. <laughs> but mouth odor, if you talk to people, people don't know you have mouth odor. For me, oh, I don't know. But no one is good about the Tisha. Uh, no. Why? Because I hate um, some. <laughs> I hate uh, uh, smelling uh, bad uh, odors. <laughs> Even at um, not to talk of uh, from mouth or body, no, that means maybe that person didn't check a. No, we see the talk for you before you turn into hospital matter. Uh, uh, the uh, normal bath. <laughs> you know, some just go into the bedroom, just pour water on their head. So there are some part of the bodies that you have to scrub well. Oh. Ah. So you wash them thoroughly. So, so that they won't bring it And before you go out, you have to have a perfume you use. Matozo. Why? Because uh, you can actually hear uh, the smell small. What did you say? But you, you might actually tell the person later that you have matozo. But if you are not sure. But with body odor, you can't, can't, you can't uh, take the smell oh! because oh God, the type of body odor that the person can have, that you can actually run away, but mouth odor, you can actually bear it. But if you cannot bear it, you can actually, uh, what you call it, you start and run away. But mouth odor, but if you have mouth odor, I can actually bear it too, but I can't bear it for a long time. What? Body odor and mouth odor. Uh, to me, there's no one is good. You know, all those ones irritate. You know, as a Christian, you know, Bible talk about how you can keep your body. Body odor, as a lady, body odor sometimes can make your fiancé or your husband to dislike you. Mm? What did you just say? Mouth odor self, you can make your friend or your friend to dislike you. For example, now they call you for a job, to go and take a job. Now, like I myself, I'm, I'm a printer. You know, I do go to company to collect job. So if you go to come to go and collect job and you have a body odor or mouth odor, the manager can come out and say, what is smelling? <laughs> Such thing alone can irritate the manager from giving you the job. <laughs> so both two is not good. So there's no one that you can manage. So the best thing is that you have to take care of yourself hygienically. All right, all right. No, I can't report. Uh, we we'll just solve it between ourselves. I better just cut my head. What if the offense is continuous? Would you ever consider reporting her to your family members? I will not do that. You are a If the offense happens to be the first time, I will like give a pardon and then have to negotiate with her. All right, all right. If she's willing to like have have a mint, okay, I'll take it uh, take it from her. But if it persists more than one or one or one, persists more than twice, then it's time for her to, to relocate. Baby, why do they talk like this now? What can I do you now? Uh, it's not.
not right. <laughs> I can't report my family member. Uh, my wife, they, they report my wife keys to my family member. It's not right. You know you can be prosecuted for that. You have to, if he offends you, you have to, um, you have to call her and discuss the issue with her. <laughs> Then, as a man, you should be able to understand relationship. Because if you put it to that, to that extent, huh, your relationship with your wife can end. <laughs> so, you'll be able to call her and, uh, and uh, talk to her. <laughs> if she didn't uh, hear you, huh, concerning the, what she, the offense she, she, she give to uh, to the man. Uh, you have to leave her on her own. Uh -uh. Why not? I will tell my husband people. <laughs> see, oh, see what my husband do for me. The cockroach just kiss back your mouth. If the woman be now, if fight come, fight must come, and you will settle the fight. <laughs> now you are talking. Because I have so many children with them, so nowhere to go.